Hi guys, this is Unforgiven, and yeah, this is a new series I'm going to be doing on my channel called Would You Rather, and I have one of my friends here today. Say hello. Hello, guys. This is uh, this is this is Jamie. So, yeah, we're going to literally get straight into this because some of these are pretty horrible. This is a series which I've kind of got off a lot of my fellow YouTube friends. So, I will ask their permission before I upload this, see if I can do the series. But hopefully, they'll say yes, and you'll be seeing this video. So let's get straight into the questions. Okay. Let's get into question number, would you rather number one, would you rather have Gary Glitter as your dad or be an incest child? Mm. So you, you go first and answer yours. Um, well, Gary Glitter's dad, you never live it down, but being an incest, you just be like, Ugh. Ugh. No, I'd rather have Gary Glitter as my dad. To be fair though, Gary Glitter, he could, he, he, seriously, mm. he, he could like feel, he your, could rape you. feel your balls while <laughs> you're like drying in the shower. Yeah. Could so, record you in the show. So are you go for Gary Glitter as your dad? Yeah, I, I would not be an incest ever. Uh, it depends, actually. Um, Unless you got a fit more. Okay, it actually depends if you're no, be, that'd be a sister. That's inbred. No, incest and inbred are the same thing. Yeah. yeah. So you're saying your sister's pretty fit. Mm. That's disgusting. Yeah. I think you go for the. Oh, I'm gonna go for the Gary Glitter as well. I don't fancy my sister shagging my brother to create me. And you can have like six or seven fingers. That is disgusting. I could have like two penises. And two toes. Just two. Just a like penis and like a, a penis toe. Or like a cock oh. nose. Like cock nose. <laughs> anyway, cock Mr. Cock you nose. You know people call you dickheads. You actually <laughs> could have a dickhead. Anyway, let's go on to the next question. You you can read this one off. If um, would you rather have a gamely relationship for a day or shag Susan Boyle? Okay, my <laughs> notes aren't very good, but still. Okay, so, so I'll answer first. So the gay relationship is this relationship for the whole day. You have to shag this man, you have to kiss yeah, this man. You have just to, the full gay The full gay experience oh, for a whole day, 24 yeah. hours. Yeah. So if I start on Tuesday at 10 o'clock, does it finish on Wednesday at 10? Yeah. Do I have to sleep with him? Yeah. That is gay. Okay, I'll go for Susan Boyle, definitely. Yeah. Yeah, definitely um, she's a woman and I do not fancy being gay, sleeping with another bloke, naked. I'll be ashamed to get a boner. Straight away, I gay relationship. What if you got a boner? Gay relationship. I'm not shagging Susan Boyle. Oh, I would go for Susan Boyle. I disagree oh, with you there. Disgusting. You. At, at least she's a woman. What do your babies look like? Could they be boy or girl? At least. No, but I, I, wouldn't, no, I, I, I would have a condom on. Think of what? Yeah. No, you're not allowed a condom. I'd still go for it then. Oh. TV on birth control. Oh, it's, it's at least a woman over a bloke. So if someone comes up to you and says, yeah, this, boy's, oh. this boy's going to bomb you. So you, you he's know, bombing so you, he's bombing you up the ass. Man comes up to you in the street and says, Oh, you're the one that shagged Susan Boyle. And the, then yeah, what would you say? Yeah, you're the, one, you're the one who had anal sex with a man that got an erection. Oh. Well done. Oh. Well done. I give, I give props to you. Oh, okay, really then. I was going this one. Would you rather stick your penis in a piranha mouth ah, or get your Jesus. bollocks run over by a truck? Mm. These are really nice, Remember healthy questions. Remember seeing the video though where a man staples his balls and then hammers them. That's, that's, that's just... That is just too much. It's got to be hot. It looked real to me as well. It probably was real, that's probably why. Some people are like sick like that, but... So, penis in a piranha mouth. So, no penis or... So, no penis. Flat bollocks. Or, no, no. or, I can actually feel the pain I, I, I at like a six ton truck. I'm getting like that sick feeling right now. That is right disgusting. Now. But, a piranha with those teeth. Ripping off your penis. I've seen it. Have you seen the film Piranha? Well, you showed me. Yeah. It gets thrown into the. Um, that is sink, disgraceful. And then you see his penis float off. Oh, see, I, see I, now I don't know. I'm going with the piranha. Oh, I'm going with my penis. It's just that Cause feeling. It, it, the question is penis in a piranha mouth. It's not like ripping your penis off, is it? Yeah, but it will. No, but it's, it's not saying that. But so bollocks run out by a truck. Bollocks run out of a truck. He's literally. That's it, your bollocks. You squished. <laughs> Piranha in mouth could just be cocky mouth situation. Cocking like, sharp there, biting uh, You can't mouth. see this, but it, there's the cock. Here he is. Here's the mouth. That's yeah. it. That is it. You have to have it in for ten minutes. That's changing the question. No, that is not the question. That is the question. No, it's not. The the, in my mouth. note, you said penis in piranha mouth. How piranha. Long, how long are you thinking? How long am I thinking? About a minute. But yeah, your bollocks would be run over in seconds. It wouldn't last very long, would it? I suppose it is that feeling where you just leave bolts on the edge of the road and then... I just imagine like your legs spread, your bollocks like 
dangling down. But as well, I think you feel more pain because you can't just run out of your bollocks. Yeah. Oh, it will, yeah, because if you could have your leg spread, the truck goes over your leg and then bang! Yeah, and it and then runs over your face as well. Just, it's not He's just carry one. On, it? It's not just one tire, though, is it? It's not like it's, if you're on a truck, it's about six. Oh. oh. No, I'll get the prana. Yeah, me too. No. Yeah, pins Pro and prana mode. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Okay, your turn to read this question. Oh, would you rather slide down a rocky hill naked into a pit of pythons, oh. pythons, or eat a dog's? <laughs> I don't think I've ever heard that one before. Okay, so the Rocky Hill. Um, let's say Everest. Everest. Yeah. How long would it take to slide down? Uh, quite a while. Naked as well. Naked, so you'd be, you'd be a bit bruised. I think you might be just you'd slightly. No, I, okay, okay. Uh, you know, you don't have broken legs and arms, right now. When you well, yeah, be able to the escape the pit of pythons? No, you wouldn't, would you? Because you're that mashed up. Dog's dick, at least you. At least you yeah. got some dignity. You could hide it as a sausage or something. You couldn't just cook no, it as a sausage. No, not really. You walk outside. Oh, dog's dick. Yeah, but you, dinner. It would be because like you could be with your mates. You could just go. What are you having to eat? Sausage? It's not really. It's a dog's dick. Dog's dick. What are you having? Porridge. What are you having Porridge. again? Dog's dick. Dog's dick. Yeah, but you can hide. What are you doing dogs. this weekend? Sliding down a rocky hill. Look, Everest it's naked into naked its boyfriends. So you're gonna die this weekend. Well, well, to be honest, I'm not being funny. I'd much prefer the dog dick because I'll probably try and get away with it as a as a sausage. How are you meant to? I'm going for the dog dick. Are you sure? Oh. I'm sure. I'm not going down at Everest. That's like, hang on, just just to quickly while you make a decision. Let's see how high Everest is. How long would it um, take to slide down Everest? Okay, my oh. No, oh, just. Okay, I can't even spell. Think of it, people. Sliding down Everest naked into a pit of pythons. Your balls smacking off all these big rocks. Yeah, smacking your head and everything. 29,000 feet. Oh. Highest mountain in the world, okay. I think you'd die though, wouldn't you? And you're at the top and you're sliding down. You're a bit cold as well. <laughs> you get hyperthermia. Basically, you're going to die. You're gonna, you're gonna die either way, but the dog stick, you know, yeah. get away with it as a sausage. Just pigs, the pain. Pigs eat them, so I reckon we're good. Okay, I'm, I'm just going to add one last one here, yeah, a mix between, would you rather get your bollocks run over by a truck or slide down Mount Everest to a pit So you're going to add two of them together? Oh yeah. shit. Oh mm. god. Mm. So uh, we're going for the same thing, so the same constellation as yes. in your balls are being you know, leg spread. Dog's dick for the that one. For so so this one. one is, so your spread legs, truck, six wheels are going over you and your face. Yeah. Do you live though? Well, you'll have to find out to do it though, won't you? No, but I, I want to know if you're going to live. I, I don't want to do it if you're not going to live. Your face will be smashed. You'll still be alive. You'll still be alive. Um, you'll be in hospital you've got a big for like the rest of your life. So, um, let's say you don't, you don't die from both of them. You just have you extreme yeah. pain. You're invincible, but the pain is still there. Yeah. Well, it's just that way. Which way would you rather die? But you don't die. So, which would be more pain to you? That's the thing. Well, if you to do come out of hospital, you can never. Fair, I, I love my balls. You will never be able to have sex, have a wank. I mean, I, I love really. my balls. No homo. I do love my. You know, I don't want my balls to be ripped off. I want my balls to be eaten. So I'm probably going for the Everest. I mean, your, uh, there's, if, there's a chance. Your balls will probably be stuck. Yeah, your balls will be ripped off. anyway. Either way, I think Everest is a lot safer as well. Yeah, but I'm no. I'm going for one over by a truck. Because Six wheels, Jay. Six hey, wheels. The pain lasts shorter. You think? Would it? Yeah. Uh, okay, then this guy, this has been Unforgiven, this has been Jamie. He doesn't have a YouTube right now, but when he eventually does, I'll link that in the description. I'll be seeing you guys in the next one.